Yo, 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 yo. I said, yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Jeremy. It's coming to you guys with another video, man. And today, here it is, bruh. Current gen, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you know, current gen, man. Yes, if you're watching the video, this is current gen. I was so against this because I want to move on and I want to, you know, focus on next gen but i can't be selfish when i still have viewers and a lot more people that would like to see me play current gen so i've come to my senses and i'll just upload content on both bro it's not a problem for me to do that at the end of the day it's just more content more videos for the channel more fun streams different streams and it's going to keep 2k playable for the majority of the year now i do have to remember that if I'm going to play both current gen and next gen, I do have to hit level 40 on next gen first and then try to do it on current gen. Or maybe I could even focus on getting level 4. I don't know. It's going to be tough. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know what I'm saying? Niggas work outside of this or whatever. So I can't just sit here and be like, oh, yeah, I'm going to just do it on both. It's going to be tough. But I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try to get it done. But my honest thoughts with this right here, guys, on, the, on like, let's be serious, bro. It's the same exact pie charts. No, no one's gonna use those new pie charts and if they do use it the bill is probably trash guys like let's just be honest like we all know 2k's moved on to next generation obviously the only reason why people play current gen is because of the simplicity of playing current gen bro it's way easier to get games in you know in terms of just loading in going to the deck and you're literally at the court in next gen you gotta load in and you gotta ride there and if you want to go to a new one you got to go over there you know what i'm saying even though there's no affiliations on current gen and there's affiliations on next gen it kind of gets ruined on next gen because of how big they make the city and it's just so it's so annoying but y'all see the build i'm making i went i went with my classic pie chart or my favorite pie chart from this 2k20 builder because guys this is this is the exact same builder as 2k20 and 2k21 and now we're in 2k22 current gen it's the exact same builder so you know what i'm saying i want my favorite pie chart which is the majority red and green because you get shooting and defending and from here i just kind of went with you know being you know having the ability to do everything now usually when i make builds like this i like to have them six five but i was like you know what this is current gen and when i come back to play current gen I'm going to be looking to have fun, bro. So, you know what I mean? I can't, you know, you're going to see eventually I end up going with a certain height of 6'3". Now, this is not the final build, guys. This is not the final build. I'm just commentating over it, showing you guys how I was kind of messing around with the build, you know, seeing what I would get and things of that nature. What I am going to do is I am going to make another video trying to replicate the two-way three-level facilitator from 2K20. Try, you know, I'm going to try to make that build in this, you know, 2K22 build system to see if the name pops up. Because they pretty much got rid of that name. I don't know what they had against that build. I don't know if it was because it was just so OP. I, I don't know what it was. But they pretty much got rid of that name or flip-flopped the name. Which was pretty ridiculous. But it is what it is. So you see me going to revamp the whole thing. And I was able to come up with this pretty quickly. Because, you know, like like I said, when I come back to this, I'm trying to have some fun. Um, now, six being 6'3", six, um, not with a 93 point rating. I don't know how much that's going to affect me, but like I said, I, I really don't care. Maybe I might revamp the build guys. This m possibly may not be my final build that I use in the park. Once I kind of see, you know, I'm gonna watch a couple of videos from other creators and other people and see what, you know, what's going on, what's dominant on current gen and I'm gonna figure it out. But from right here, you know, typically this is how I like to roll. I don't usually go any other direction when you know when I'm making builds I make them how I want to play I make them for me I don't make it to please people or to make you know to get a specific name I just make the build how I want to play the game bro and then I go from there so you see right there the stats pretty much remain neutral so I was like all right it is what it is we'll stay at 6-3 you know the defense is great good handle good enough you know good shooting um and when you're able to do uh, you know pretty much a mixture of everything the player ends up being really really good so that's just my personal opinion on it but um yeah like i said this may not be my final build but this is what we got when we made this build you guys see from the title or if it's not in the title you're about to see it in five four three two one two-way mid-range facilitator so hey man it ain't what it is but yo we gonna get straight into the badges and see how i would actually you know utilize it on these on this player right here man 
all right y'all so now going into the badges all right y'all know how it is on current gen it's plus four so remember add plus four to these stats and add plus i think it's what plus eight to the physicals if you're doing if it's still plus four for the um <clears throat> 99 and plus four for the gym rat <clears throat> you should get plus eight to the physicals um yeah so this build's pretty bro i ain't gonna lie man this build is nasty bro like <clears throat> this build is very nasty great shooting great defense be, you know being able to have that 80 ball control her pro dribble moves um good layup good dunk you know the ability to dunk when you're wide open you can't contact dunk but still <clears throat> being able to dunk the ball is always valuable so it is what it is um and honestly i ain't gonna lie y'all like feel me i've been playing next gen and i will eventually start to play current gen but bruh <clears throat> you know the badges all of this has been the same since 2k20 <clears throat> I feel like the only reason people play current gen is simply because of the simplicity to play it, where you could just simply load in and play the game. Cause bruh, come on now, man. Like, are you, is people really enjoying looking at the same badges and the same build, <clears throat> the same pie chart? It's just not making any sense to me, but you know, it is what it is, man. <clears throat> I'll just put that for now. And then um, for the shooting, uh, okay, so they added all uh, these shooting badges to this also. So we'll just go with where is this? Where is the badge I'm looking for? Where is the badge? Where's the limitless badge on this game, bro? Like, is it down more or something? Is it to the side? Am I missing it? Blinders, catch, shoot, circus, green machine, faded, super shots. There he goes. Limitless spot. I don't know why I had trouble spotting that. Um, we'll do stop and pop on bronze. Uh, Green Machine will do that Hall of Fame. Um, what else will we do? I ain't gonna lie, man. Yeah, I saying, cause I'm gonna I'm gonna use this. Oh, we'll do Rhythm Shooter on um Hall of Fame. I'm gonna use this build eventually. So for now, we'll, we'll, just, do, we'll, we'll just do like that for now. Um, I'm not gonna really go too crazy with it. I'm just gonna use the build. I mean, I'm just gonna, you know, showing you guys how I possibly would upgrade the build. But uh, bronze unpluckable. Um, if you guys don't know, if did they add quick change to this too? Yeah, quick change is also very important this year. Um, handles for days and quick first step. If I could find it, there it goes. So those are essentially the most important badges. You have to have quick change to be able to dribble around. Um, hyperdrive is pretty much eh, if you want to when you're dribbling down the court. We'll just leave it like we'll just leave it like that for now. We'll go with Bronze Ball Stripper. We'll go Hall of Fame Clamps, Hall of Fame Menace, Hall of Fame Intimidator, um, and just Hall of Fame Pickpocket, just for the time being. I don't know if we're missing something. We got Pickpocket, Menace, Clamps, Intimidator, Ball Stripper. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, yeah, I don't know. I would, I would probably go with this. And if I had to add one more badge, probably, probably that. So. Yeah, bro. What I'm gonna do is go to the uh the little the what do you call it the boat because I haven't been there yet, and I'm gonna give my thoughts on current gen. All right, so just just looking at this right off the rip, um everything is pretty much accessible right in front of you. You got the main lobby, you got the rec center right there. Um, what else is there? Gallery. I want to know how I get to the neighborhood. Uh, you can go back to my team, I guess. Um, elevator. Use the elevator. Uh, okay, so once you go to the elevator, uh, you pretty much get the 2v2 deck, 3v3 deck, pro and yam. And I guess this is where you go buy stuff because I see that shopping bag. So we're going to go over here. Uh, deuces, six, have you? Yeah, so I'm not going to lie, bro. I, I, I like that, bro. And I like that a lot. Um, just being able to load in right here and just go play the game is huge, bro. It's literally huge. And it's a big part of the reason why a lot of people are playing current gen, bro. Like, literally, it's a big part of the reason why people are playing current gen. Like, if you just load in right here, all the courts are right here in front of you. Um, You got 2v2 on the other side. So, not to say that oh it's super super lit or you know what i'm saying or whatever the case may be no nah, nah, not necessarily but it's convenient bruh and this is the main reason why the community is still split 
are both gameplays good yes be people are having fun on both games i'm having fun on next gen and current gen looks like it's not that bad of a time either even though um it's literally the same exact builders the same exact badge lineup the same you know what i'm saying in terms of how it looks it looks just like 2k 20 21 and 22 all the same the only way that I feel like 2K is going to finally be able to get everybody to focus strictly on next gen, and I hate doing this every single year, but when 2K23 comes out, they're going to have to do it. If they don't do it, then it just is what it is at that point. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, you know, it's just going to stay like this until further notice, but they have to make it just simple to play games in, in next gen. And until then, you know what I'm saying? People are going to keep playing current gen. And honestly, the, the the content creators are gonna keep on uploading um, current gen too, if that's where the views are at. Are some of them actually enjoying playing current gen? Yeah, but a lot of them are just gonna keep playing, doing this if the views are there. So I can't blame anybody. It is what it is, man. But y'all, you know what to do, bro. Um, if y'all wanna really see me upgrade this player to a, you know, you know, if y'all wanna see me upgrade him to 85, let's get this video to 30 likes. 30 likes, bro. 30 likes. If we get 30 likes on this video, then I know for a fact current gen is highly sought after. If we don't get 30 likes, then I know, uh, you know, eventually I'll upgrade them. But for now, I won't. But if we get 30 likes on this video, mark my words, I will upgrade this build to 85 overall. So, you already know what it is, man. Leave a like, drop your comments down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and hit that notification bell so you guys never miss another upload. It's your boy John Ranks, and I'm out, y'all. Peace. Gang. They cannot do it like him. Uh huh.